welcome back to my channel i'm back with another video this is two videos within the same week like come on now consistency is key and i'm gonna keep pushing out these videos for y'all so anyways again welcome back to my channel if you're new here thanks for stopping by i hope you stay a while if you're a returning subscriber and you've been here before thank you for rocking with me and while you're here don't forget to like comment and subscribe and turn on your post notifications because i'm posting consistently these days so i say all that to say today i got a haul for y'all this is definitely different it's definitely new and i feel like this will be me being more into my fashion bag and literally showing up that's i'm not editing that out <laughs> i'm just keep it rolling this is gonna be more so of like a fashion video because i went shopping at goodwill so i have a haul that i want to show y'all and basically what i plan to do is everything that i got from goodwill i'm either going to be upcycling it or just using certain pieces as fabric to turn into something totally different from what it actually is so i got like an oversized button up that i i don't plan to wear as a button up i'm going to use it to like add to a pair of jeans so if you get my drift you see what i'm kind of talking about so yeah that's pretty much what this video is going to consist of is just the haul today and then in the coming days or week or weeks um i'm going to be making an outfit or like not a whole probably not a whole outfit but i plan to like make some jeans out of one of these pieces so yeah that's going to be coming soon because i need the outfit by may 13th so I have to get on actually making it and making sure that I like what I make and just making sure it fits. So this should be fun. It's gonna be it's gonna be a lot to show y'all, but if you're interested in these types of videos, I'm pretty sure you will enjoy it. I have a lot of fun pieces to show y'all. Some pieces I am gonna wear as is, but for the most part, I bought things solely for the purpose of okay, I like this fabric, I like this design, I like this color, and I can use it for something else. So this is gonna be pretty fun on my channel. So definitely, like I said, subscribe, share this video with your friends, your family, or someone who is interested in fashion and designing and arts and craft type stuff because I promise I'm gonna be posting more of those type of videos on my channel. I'm still gonna come with the vlogs every now and then when I have something that's vlog worthy, but for the most part, I am here to kind of really be a creative content creator. So. Yeah, without further ado, yes, I'm about to just show y'all what I got. Like two bags full of stuff from the bill. I grabbed this because if y'all are familiar with it, um, it's like I'm gonna try to link a picture so y'all can know what I'm talking about. But I grabbed this because it'd be great for that type of fabric, like the the rug or like carpet looking. It's like a blanket, like a like a heavy duty blanket, and they do like patchwork with the jeans um this is the fabric so it's that material so i can use this and kind of turn it into some patchwork as well so i just got this for the sake of the fabric it's kind of what i was talking about when i say i go into goodwill to like shop for certain pieces of fabric and not necessarily pieces of clothing for clothing itself so i hope that makes sense and this is another piece that I got solely for the fabric and I love the color brown so I'm definitely going to do something with this I'm not sure yet but because it's kind of like a really thick material so I feel like it's too hot for the summertime so maybe something winter related like I don't know yet because I'm not gonna wear it like this at all definitely plan to like do something with this whether I do like a crop jacket or um maybe i can make it to like a two-piece i don't know yet but i like the colors of it it's a unique type of print and design on here so grabbed it for 5.99 i love this skirt because i love this color i feel like this is a pop of color i need in my wardrobe because i don't have any pieces like this so this is definitely a great ad because you can dress this up in so many different ways yes it's a bold color but it's also very versatile and you can really style it to your liking depending on your personality and the type of style you want to go for you're gonna have fun with this so i got this for 4.99 nice little skirt and i'm pretty sure i'm gonna have to resize this as well because it's gonna be a little too big for me um 
I'm already knowing. I also got this jacket. I'm gonna just wear this as is. I thought this was pretty cute. Um, it's Rosona and it still has a tag on it and it was $40 originally, but I only got it for $10. So let me try it on for y'all. So yeah, this is actually really cute. Um, a little bag. Um, yeah, this is a nice cute little jacket. So this is a great buy. And this is the piece that I got just for the sake of fabric. It's just, it was this skirt, but I got it because it's like, what is it called? Like velvet. So I'll see what I use this as in the future. And then this piece, I actually plan to like make this into a swimsuit. Cause it's like the swimsuit material, spandex and like mesh like. I, this was originally like a little skirt and actually may have been like a little swimsuit cover up. I don't know, but it has a zipper on it. I don't know, but anyways, I plan to turn it into like a little two piece, either like a bandeau, a bandeau. What is it, like a halter top type? Like a, is it bandeau? Bandeau top or how you say it. And then like the bottoms, if they, whether they be shorts or like, um, the bikini bottoms oh yeah it's like this lace material at the top and y'all get a closer look at it six well 5.99 so yeah plan to like use this and probably have this lace part of the top portion of this swimsuit so that's what i plan to do with this and then this is also just like a piece of scrap fabric but it's also like this suede material um so it's like good quality a lot of the things that i'm thinking about is like pants like i really want to like grab different types of fabric to make different type of pants because you know you get tired of the rec the blue jean pants black pants like your regular pants that you buy at the store and i kind of want to make more pants into like unique pieces so i'm trying to do like different textures patterns i'm just creating different styles for pants so that's why i'm like grabbing different pieces and different fabrics to play around and see what I can come up with. So I'm just trying to have fun with it. The moment I stop having fun with it, I'll be done with it. <laughs> Let me know who that is in the comments. I'll give y'all five dollars. These are like my favorite two. Hold on. I know they probably look the same. Are they the same? Like honestly, I don't think they are because I got them from like different sections. But hold on. Now that I think about it. Okay, this is studio something. Are they actually are from the same are these the same this one's lighter and this one's darker but quick story time <sighs> so i got this because one of my best friends is graduating next month in may and her favorite color is green so for her graduation i thought it'd be cute to kind of like design some type of set with these i think i'm gonna do like jeans or like a skirt um we'll see but i'm excited for these because it's like some really good quality fabric and i'm just so excited to just see what i come up with because honestly i'm just freestyling for most of this but let me just see what i can do with this really quick and if y'all see me look in here it's because i have a mirror right there um and i could actually like wear this as like a over no nah, this isn't it's not long enough to wear as like an oversized dress otherwise that would have been cute with like some long thigh high boots with this i mean honestly i could i still have like um some shorts like some shorts and then like long thigh high boots that'd kind of be cute and if i wanted to like tie this up i'm always tying something i swear and then wear this shirt i have underneath this throwing everything off but um yeah this is like a really cute color and it actually looks really good on me i ain't gonna lie Hold on, I might have did something with this. Like, I really like this. So, we're going to see what I come up with in the days to come. Because I have to start working on the outfit since the graduation is May 13th. So, I definitely need to have the outfit put together at least a few days before then. So, that video will be coming soon, whatever I decide to make. So, yeah, we'll see if I, like, wear these oversized with some long boots and like have like shorts underneath it like some blue jeans shorts or something 
yeah honestly i'm gonna have fun with this we gonna see and then i got this this is like a really vibrant tie-dye shirt and i was like okay i gotta get this because it's so vibrant and just like the perfect tie-dye i'm gonna use this i think i'm gonna make my niece like a tote bag out of this um i think that'd be fun for the summer you know if we go to the beach or anything nice little like very pop of color tie-dye tote bag and she likes stuff like this so that's gonna be in another video as well a do-it-yourself tote bag with me and i probably do like different styles of tote bags as i gather fabric and different ideas i'll just compile them together and have one video for that so definitely stay tuned for that as well that'll be coming to your youtube channel feed soon and then i got this blank jersey like baseball jersey and i plan to add my own customized letters and numbers on this so that'll be in another video i may just like wear this oversized yeah it's gonna be oversized for sure and so it'd be cute because i plan to wear this to like a white Sox game since this looks like their jersey um so yeah that'd be fun i have this and yeah we're gonna see we're gonna see and honestly now that i think about it so i have this and i also have i found this oversized like what do you call this zipper what do you call these sweatshirts i don't think that's what it's called but anyways i got it because i love this color blue and then it has it says chicago but i think i'm going to like cut out these letters and play around with it on something and I could play around with it like with this I don't know yet but definitely gonna be turning this into something where they'd be like I can make this into like a two-piece set like a top and like shorts or a skirt as time goes on and I continue to think about it different ideas will come up so we'll see what happens and then I found this cute skirt actually is it a skirt or is it shorts they're shorts. I found these cute shorts. I love it because it's like this, um, whatever pattern you want to call this or design. It's different. Like I said, I go in there trying to find different things with different patterns that are like unique. So this was definitely something that I liked and it caught my eye. So these would be cute. Um, nice little shorts. So yeah, these are only $4.99. And this is also another piece that I got solely for the fabric. It's more suede and inside. We can use the inside for fabric too. You can, you gotta be versatile. Like you just have to be creative with your creativity. You know, like think outside the box, think big. Um, but yeah, like I would not wear this <laughs> as a skirt for real. So this is another piece I got for um, scraps of fabric. And then this, I don't know yet, but I probably use this as freestyle for fabric as well. It actually kind of, I can like mix and match. I pair these two together for like some contrast and complementary colors, um, or like color scheme type vibe going on. So yeah, we'll see what we can do with these pieces as well. Like I said, I'm so excited because you really can have fun with so many things. Just go to the wheel and put stuff together, like make it your own. And this is another piece that I got for the fabric itself. Um, I feel like I want to make like a cute top out of this. <sighs> so my camera keeps overheating and I hate it. As I was saying, this is another piece that I bought just for the fabric. Um, don't know what I'm going to turn it into, but I'm thinking like some type of tank top or like halter top. Because I'm not wearing it as a skirt. Well, I don't know. I could wear it as a skirt, honestly. If I like resize it and make it to like my to my liking, put like a little slit, you never know with me. And then I really like these. This is like a more laid back, <laughs> casual type vibe. I just really like the print on these. Um, and I thought they were pretty chill, nice pair of shorts. They're really soft, and I just really like these. This was just like okay, I'm gonna wear these as is. It'd be cute. I'm not really trying to try things on for real. I guess I could. Yeah, these are some nice like little, little like vibe going on. Now, this, I can't wait to actually make something out of this because look at this print y'all. Like I got it for the fabric. This is like a little blazer as you can see. And I think I'm going to like, I want to make this into a dress. 
like this would be such a cute dress or maybe add it add fabric to some jeans I already had like I don't know yet but I just love the colors on this this is like the last thing also I got as far as clothes I already know what I'm going to be doing with this I'm just gonna like um cut this collar off right here don't want the collar but I'm going to wear this as cropped top so kind of just like the other one I showed y'all the green one but I'm gonna take I'm definitely taking this collar off and then I'm going to have this tied like so and then I kind of want to bring in the arms to make it a little bit tighter on me I don't know yet but I'm definitely gonna make some adjustments to make sure it's to my liking so I'm not sure if I'm gonna bring it in or not but yeah so just like a little cute um top going on and I have some pants on that everything I didn't get these from Goodwill, but they're already in my closet. But I think it'd be nice if I pair these with this top. And then I have this purse that I also got from Goodwill, like this peach color purse. So do y'all kind of get the gist of what I'm going for? Hold on, let me just, hold on one second. Okay, I just had to like try it on for y'all really quick. So um, hopefully I don't look too crazy. I'm gonna like stand up on this so y'all can kind of see the outfit. <laughs> hopefully the camera catches it. So I got these pants. And then I got the shirt, can y'all see? And then I got this purse, and I probably wear it with like some white shoes. So it's kind of like the colors all kind of complement each other. Um, so let me know what y'all think of this outfit. I think it'd be really cute. And I'm gonna like add straps to this purse. I got it from the wheel, but it didn't come with long straps. So I'm gonna add some myself because I kind of want this to be a crossbody bag and not a like just handbag. Yeah, let me know what y'all think of this outfit because I think the colors. Are really cute it's different and i'm trying to step out of my normal like wardrobe because it's not like this at all <laughs> like i'm trying to add more colors different schemes yeah i think this would be cute like i really like this outfit i got these pants from um this place called follows by my house so if you're familiar with it i keep calling it follows um it's called forming mills you know the correction forming mills yeah yeah so let me know if it's matching. I'm not gonna wear these pink socks, but like I said, I'm gonna wear some white shoes with them. <laughs> Let me know what y'all think. I'm trying to get into fashion. I'm trying to, you know, work on my style and I'm a, I'm a newbie, I'm not gonna lie. I'm no fashion designer. I'm just trying to put some pieces together that I think would be fun and cute. And yeah, I don't know what with dazzle. So let me know what y'all think. I also found this cute like beach bag. It still has a tag on it. It was $20 from Walmart, this is no boundaries. And I got it for $7, so yeah, cute little summer beach bag vibes. Yeah, I really like this, really cute, really cute. And then I found this really cute blue purse. I need to find something to wear with this, but yeah, nonetheless, really cute color. So, got this purse, and I also got this little like tote bag. It's, really simple but i feel like with the right outfit it'll just be something to balance like an outfit out um and it's just yeah something to have you know you never know what you can wear this with so i got this and it was only what five dollars that was that and i have one item which is this skirt i forgot about this so this i'm actually wearing as is i'm gonna show y'all how it looks on me because I love this skirt like it's so cute it was only five dollars and it's like it's kind of small and but I'm small so it's okay but let me try it on for y'all hold on okay let me stop playing so as I was saying um I got this really cute skirt like I'm gonna wear this as is um yeah I really like this like invite me outside this summer because this skirt she gonna be outside and i'm gonna be right with her um but yeah i really like this skirt i actually probably wear this to san francisco i'm going to san francisco the following week after my friend's graduation so that'll be a vlog for y'all this is like the last piece of the haul and as y'all just saw me playing around i think this purse would be a good like something to match with it like it's I don't know it's different but I think it's cute like these colors kind of mesh well so if I can find a good top to go with this skirt 
in this purse and then find some shoes i think they'd be cute like i don't know tell me what y'all think we were just paying attention to the skirt and the purse right now um because i really like these two like pairing these together um we're gonna see so i'm pretty much i'm excited for all the stuff that i got because these are all very unique things like i said sta staple pieces things you can kind of like play with have fun with and you know freestyle so that was pretty much the end of the vlog so i hope y'all enjoyed this little haul i know i didn't really try a lot of pieces on because i'm not using them to wear as pieces i'm using it for fabric so again stay tuned for my next video because like i said i'm going to be creating videos and showing y'all what i'm doing with certain pieces and what i'm making it into so it'll be like a nice fun do it yourself walkthrough video like it's not like a tutorial because i'm not i'm not a skilled seamstress but i know how to break a sewing machine as long as you know how to break it you can do a lot like trust me yeah, so it's not really like a tutorial but it'll be fun and just like a walk through watch me do it type video so i'm excited to create the video and then put it out so that you guys can watch it as well so again that's going to be coming up on my channel soon and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up let me know what y'all like what y'all want to see more of and what y'all looking forward to because i want to just put out so many different types of videos and i'm coming i'm coming to y'all with the content so like i said stay tuned for more videos so again thank y'all for tuning in if you made it to the end of the video i appreciate y'all as always and i will see y'all in my next video until next time ttyl